Kumbati Mommy! Hello my dear Kumbatis! Welcome back to my channel. It's Julie Gregory again for another baby led weaning video. My previous videos were loads of information about the how to's and the why's of baby led weaning. Hence, I thought of documenting what my bub eats in a day so you will all have a better picture of how baby led weaning works. Well, for me, at least. Also, I received a private message asking if I'm still breastfeeding or have I stopped or am I exclusively pumping now since my bub drinks from an open cup. Well, the answer is no. I still am breastfeeding and at the same time pumping so I can get some milk and mix it with my bub's food when I cook. And also, of course, for him to practice the open cup drinking. I will talk about it more at the end of the video, but for now, enough of my blah blah and let's watch this docu-series. So here we are. What my baby eats in a day. Baby led weaning, 9 months old. Our day usually starts with his first feed at 6 in the morning. Then he goes back to sleep. It's half past 7 now, he just woken up. Morning, Jimmy Jim Jim. I don't boob him at this hour. We just go straight to breakfast. It's 7.45 in the morning. He mostly does independent play while I prepare our brekkie. For today, I will start with something simple yet healthy. Just toasting some wholemeal bread and we'll be making omelette. I'm throwing some breast milk as well. This will be his beverage for the morning while I'm gonna have my decaf coffee. Mmm, we both need milk. For the omelette, I'm making it with some chopped baby spinach and grated cheddar cheese. Now our toast is done, I'm just buttering it up and I've added garlic powder here. This is my DIY garlic bread. Sprinkle some parsley to feel like a chef. Cut them into short strips for pincer grasp practice. Viola! Spinach and cheese omelette, garlic bread and banana fruit. In case you're wondering, I'm having the same, just with coffee. Quarter past eight. Say grace before meals. In the name of Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. James is using a smock from Little Chumps Australia. I love this product. Perfect for baby led beating messy meal times. Good morning, everyone. It's 8.15 in the morning. We're having breakfast. Um, by the way, I haven't done anything with my face. This is my raw face. <laughs> Raw, this is what you get. Anyway, <laughs> I usually pump while we're having breakfast. So we have breakfast together, we enjoy meals together. That's the beauty of baby led weaning. So Jimmy is now having his breakfast and I've got my pump set up. And this is hands-free. So I'm gonna pump while I eat. All right, see you later. James is like, what are you doing, mom? Who are you talking to? I'm talking to the Kumbatis. Our Kumbati family, yeah? Even if I'm with James 90% of the time, I still pump milk so he can practice drinking from an open cup and I use breast milk in cooking some of his foods like sauces, pancakes, or oats. Do you want milk? Milk? You want this? You want milk? <laughs> All right, I'm so excited. All right, let's take your plate away and put it aside. There you go. Both hands, please. Gentle and slow. Do you want more? Do you want more food? Huh? No? Okay. Here you go. Yeah. Hold. All done! All done! Okay. Beep off, please. Hands. I'm just gonna show you the aftermath. That's what's in his bib. There's a bit of milk spill in there. This is what's left of the banana. And then some bits and pieces of the omelette this chair I've done my coffee I finished all the bread and that's just what's remaining of the egg I put the news back on I continue to watch the news while James just 
plays there. Sometimes he goes out to the stairs or goes to me in the kitchen. I mean, I just have to follow him around. This gate is it's a playpen. It's a very open space even with the gate. I just put that there so he can hang onto it and cruise around the living room for him to practice walking. It's 10.45 in the morning. I boob him for his morning tea and then he goes for his morning nap. I'm just preparing his water now. He drinks cooled boiled water. The tap water here in Australia is fairly clean. While James is asleep, I'm just gonna prepare lunch. Just using up this leftover avocado. I wanted to make an avocado pasta, um, avocado sauce for the pasta, but this avocado is a bit junk. Not really a bit junk, it's already junk. So I'm just gonna have to improvise. I'm gonna use banana and yogurt instead. The breast milk. Am I measuring? No, I just eyeball it. Now I got your pasta sauce. Since he is still asleep, I'll just make our afternoon tea now. I'm using wheat bix here. It's low sugar, high in iron cereal. This is pasta water. Trusty blender. Oh, James is waking up. Time check, it's 11.45. Some more feed. Alternate boob now. Sometimes it's 5 or 15 minutes. Sometimes it's an hour. But I'm not complaining. It's all part of breastfeeding. Jimmy Jim Jim is now waking up. Oh, look at that face. Going back, let's finish off this with big snacks. Sweeten it up with pure maple syrup. Roll into balls and coat with unsweetened coconut flakes. Here we are. Today's lunch is green penne pasta with a leftover omelette from breakfast. I still have some leftover breast milk that I just thawed and used for cooking. And of course, I let my baby use the best feeding sets ever invented, in my opinion. This is for the afternoon tea later. With Big's Apple Bliss Balls. Served with fresh blueberries. Lunch is ready, Bubba. You're gonna wear a smock because we're having a saucy lunch. For mommy, I'm having um, zucchini and ham pasta. This is what I really love about baby led weaning because the baby feeds himself independently and you get to enjoy meals together. Isn't it, James? We enjoy meals together, Baba. <laughs> yeah. You want your meal? Yeah? <laughs> this is the leftover meal from earlier that I used to cook. Both hands, please. We just had lunch. Jimmy, show them, Jimmy. I just washed, I just washed his hands and face and neck. So anyway, you see, you seeing the smock, Little Chumps Australia smock, it's clean. I don't have to bathe him like three times a day. He doesn't have to eat naked. He doesn't have to have a bath every after meal. And he can wear the same shirt that he is wearing. <laughs> right, James? All right, playtime and for me to clean up. I give water in between meals, especially that it's really hot today. He drinks it from a straw cup. It's four o'clock in the afternoon and we just got home from an afternoon stroll. He slept on the ride home and now he's back on the boob for his afternoon tea. He hasn't had the Whitbix balls yet. <laughs> and switch boobs. Jimmy is a feeder. He always drinks from both sides. He's off. He's done. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You got a cover. Cover. <laughs> cover. It's snack time. I'll just use the bib because. Mm. Oh. 
This is mommy. Oh, uh, oh, hold, hold on. Ah, uh, for you. Oh, here you go. Mm. You still have one there, oh. Huh? This one, you eat that again. There's only one left. We'll just save that for my husband. <laughs> save that for Daddy Anak. No, that's for Daddy Anak. That's it for his afternoon snack. Hmm? <laughs> I just give him water because he's got he just had a feed half an hour ago. I don't account as to how much water he drinks. I just offer it if he wants it and now offer it to him. Unlimited water. He can have as much as water as he wants because he's eating three meals a day. And now I'm starting to introduce snacks as well. He's nine months old, so he's gonna have um, breakfast, morning tea, lunch, afternoon tea, and then dinner. Yeah, I'm gonna start that. But we didn't have morning tea earlier. We didn't have morning tea earlier, isn't it? Yeah, he just had the breast fade and then he fell asleep. But I'll start to offer him. Um, we, we just did a checkup a few days ago and the nurse said that I can start offering three meals and two snacks a day. So I'll start doing that. All done! You gotta clean you up. For dinner, I'm upcycling our leftover foods from yesterday. We had stir fry veggies last night. I'm just adding soup to it and mung beans. Fried garlic rice to give it a new look. I already portioned for baby before seasoning these with salt. This is one of the perks of baby led weaning. You don't have to cook separately for your baby. Saves a lot of time and a lot of money. Here is baby's dinner. Deconstructed beef in mung bean soup and rice balls. For the soup, I'm serving it in his tiny cup. It is important to add meat in baby's diet. Meat is a good iron and protein source. It is easily absorbed by the body compared to plant sources. Even at 6 months, I have introduced meat already to James. He just sucked out the juice, getting all the iron from it. 20 past 7 in the evening. This will be his supper. And then he'll go to bed. That's it for the whole day. Good night. See ya. And that's a wrap. That's how our baby led weaning journey looks like in a day. Before I end this video, I just want to share to you how breastfeeding works while the baby is on solids. There is a saying, food under one is just for fun because the primary source of nutrition is still milk. Aside from the natural and optimal nutrition for my bub, breastfeeding has a gazillion benefits. I just can't stress it enough. I did make a couple of dedicated videos about the benefits of breastfeeding for mothers and the babies. But most of all, I just find breastfeeding a loving connection between me and my baby and it helps us both relax and fall asleep. Meanwhile, pumping alongside is a task that doesn't go unnoticed. It may seem a lot of work, but if you have the right equipment, it's easy as. I do this to transition from the nipple to an open cup straight away. Also, it helps with the speech and language development, promotes good dentition, helps with gross and fine motor skills, dexterity, and most of all, it promotes independence. And hopefully, by next year when James goes to daycare, he can drink by an open cup independently with minimal spillage. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you've learned a thing or two. Like everything else in life, baby led weaning may be hard from the start, but it does get easier. So just hang in there and enjoy the ride. All the best to your weaning journeys, my dear kumbatis. Cheers to you for choosing to do baby led weaning. Don't forget to hit that notification bell to get updates on our videos. Follow me on my other socials as well at Kumbati Mami, Facebook and Instagram. And I shall see you soon. Thank you once again. Like and subscribe. Bye. Mwah. Yeah. Yeah, clean up your mess, little boy. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Very curious!